Oh, hi, villagers. Welcome back to the village. If you are new, hello, welcome. I'm Kai. And today we're going to be talking about Dispo and his new Awoken skill coming to Dragon Ball Z Universe 2 and what we think about it. Um, if it might be, will be for CACs. Um, the English translations, or they officially posted this on the Dragon Ball official for the English side of things. And yeah, we literally, I just recorded a video actually just before they did it. Literally like maybe like 10, 20 minutes before they did this. I recorded a video going over the Japanese one, talking about the Awoken skill. So we're here again to record, but this time it's in English. <laughs> um, so yes, let's just kind of read what they say because maybe we'll find something a little bit different. Hailing from the ranks of Universe 11's heroic pride troopers, the supersonic warrior Dispo is coming to Xenoverse 2. When it comes to speed, no other warrior can handle or could hold a candle to Dispo. Even light itself gets left in the dust. Okay, guys. And as you guys already seen the screenshots. The Wilkins skill honestly looks sick. Um moving forward here so i just wanted to read this little clip here because this is what kind of gave us insight to the form originally so let's talk about it again but this time translated to english um and since he'll be joining the game as a playable character all that speed is yours to harness close to the distance i'll close the distance between you and your enemies in a blink of an eye and unleash dispose a wide array of attacks before they know what hit them his awoken skill is supersonic mode so that's going to be the official name of the awoken skill not super speed mode or light speed mode or whatever it is supersonic mode further increases his movement speed and buffs certain attacks at the cost of constantly draining key so knowing when to use it will be the key to victory for this character okay so this is looking so when i originally talked about this um i thought that this was going to be a super saiyan god Esque awoken skill but it's looking like it's actually gonna be similar to blue evolution in this well i think it's gonna be a combination of the two almost because i think what they're gonna do is is when they say certain buff certain attacks i almost feel like it's going to be basics i think it's gonna be basics only he's gonna get an insane movement speed buff and then he's also gonna be having the key drain so i don't know how monstrous the key drain is gonna be but how they word it it seems like it might be on par with evolution blue key drain I don't know. I really, I don't know what they're gonna do with this one. Um, yeah, I, um, I'm, I don't know. <laughs> uh, so I kind of wanted to talk about this Awoken skill for CACs. I think that there is definitely a possibility that we could see this. I don't know, kind of how they're wording this and stuff. I, I feel like we could possibly see this Awoken skill for our CACs, and it be for all races. So we'd have something. For everyone, that is what a lot of the videos that I've, we've been making lately have been about. Um, talking about Ultra Ego, talking about Ultra Instinct. We want that. Come on, guys. I know y'all want that too. Um, um, on walking skill for every race in the game. Come on. All we got is Kyle Ken, a potential unleash. We need a little bit more. Something new, something fresh. And I think this walking skill in particular could be really healthy for the game because. Super Saiyan God, when it came out for Saiyans, really good. Those basic, that basic attack awoken skill, really nice. So I think something else, I think this could be good too. Um, I really just, we got to get our hands and play with this one because it, it's something very different. You know, I, uh, Take the Gamer actually did help me with the last video and he's um, helped me with getting this information too because I, I, I started seeing stuff popping up. I'm like, okay, we got to make a video. Um, but yeah, he kind of thought it was going to drain stamina. But just when it generally when they say energy, it, it translates to key. So that's why I figured it was going to drain the key. Um, stamina for me, though, would have made more sense. But, I, you know, let me know what you guys think about this form in the comment section below. I really do think, though, that this this could potentially be an awoken skill we get for our CSCs. Um, If we do cosmetically, they don't have to really do too much. I mean, just give us the purple aura. That, that's kind of it. This one's a really easy one for them to implement. It, it and just like look at the screenshots real quick guys look at the screenshots of him actually transforming unleashing his key that looks sick this they did a really good job with this just based on the screenshots i am looking forward to the content city tv whenever we do get it and what we're actually going to be seeing his gameplay seeing his combo seeing him actually transform i think it's going to look really cool because we can see justice kick justice blade and circle flash they all look kind of cool here in the screenshots but we you know obviously when we get the actual gameplay we'll be able to tell how they're going to actually look uh 
man i actually just rewatched the fight between golden frieza gohan and dispo and let me say that was actually really quality gohan performed really well in that fight i think you know it was a tag team i honestly i i didn't i don't know this was this was strong man he could tangle with frieza and gohan i mean shoot that's kind of crazy honestly to think about that this guy is so strong he's able to fight two of universe seven strongest like he's those are two are literally like just right below vegeta and goku but like those two are the strongest out that outside of them too so it's like he was able to mess around with both of them not even just one it took both of them to take him out so he should be really interesting to see in game really quick though guys i also wanted to mention we need base topo okay we have all the pride troopers no we have dispo and his transformation we have Jiren and his transformation. We need Topo. That's it. Base Topo needs to be in the game. I'm sorry. I, I went a little overboard there. <laughs> um, let me know in the comment section below. I wanted to ask you guys, what is a character that we need to complete a set? Um, basically, like, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Goku, Vegeta, Broly, or, you know, Goku, Gohan, Goten. Uh, those probably aren't sets. Goku Black Zamasu, Merge Zamasu. That's probably an example of a set. So let me know what you guys think of a set that we need to finish. Because a lot of people are going on. We finished the Pride Trooper Trio. So, yeah, we kind of did. But we still need the other Pride Troopers. But yeah, so that's why I feel like it's still kind of incomplete. But yeah, let me know what you guys want to see as another completed set. But yeah, guys. Something that uh, actually I saw a few people talking about online too is that I'm really interested to see how his combos turn out because they look pretty cinematic. Um, I think Cabby said something about that on Twitter as well. Um, I, I think with the combos, I think we can really see something cool. Uh, I don't know if maybe if we got this for our CACs, it could even change our combos similar to how God, it doesn't really change them too much more like get like a close up more, but maybe we could see our combos change too. That would be something, an extra addition we can get uh, for our CACs, but yeah, this one i i really want it for our CACs. i really do just because it's so free it's so easy it would not take that much effort from them to give us the purple skin or not the purple skin give us the purple aura and that's literally it there's no physical changes really you don't get buffer you don't get more slender you don't get nothing and even if we did they wouldn't change that so all they need to do is give us the purple aura and we're set and then all the other races in the game can enjoy this whole thing um, I think that mostly wraps up what I wanted to say today, guys. I hope you did enjoy this video, and I, I hope that maybe we can start a conversation in the comment section below. You know, y'all think we get the walking skill, y'all think we don't. Let me know. With that, though, guys, I'm Kai. Peace.